should the pregnant British schoolgirl who joined IS be allowed to return to the UK? No, said 76%. I just want them to put aside everything they've heard about me on the media and just have an open mind about why I left and who I am now. Every week we are sending mails to your governments. The must respond we received is, we want the children without the mothers. And it's in inhuman for me, we cannot do that. We cannot ignore the threat posed by those who chose to engage with the conflict in Syria or Iraq. When I entered Syria, they directly took my passport. And they said, because you're new and you have no house, uh, you can stay here for a while. It was a prison full with women. When we arrived in ISIS, I had no clue of there being slaves in the 21st century. They were being bought and sold. What was the moment that you felt that Dawla is not the right place to practice your Islam? A uh, moment that you were like, this is not the Islam that I came for. For me personally, it was when I realized that I can't leave. You're always forced into marriage again, and again, and again, and yeah. again. I don't know. It was just, it was a big mess. They see the crimes that ISIS committed and they feel like I'm responsible for those crimes because I came and I supported these crimes. But that's not true. And I feel like most journalists, when they came to meet me, they had the intention of making me look bad, not the intention of getting the true story.